CFJC Sports and TRU Athletics bring you TRU Wolfpack's Weekend Wrap. Both soccer teams were in action this weekend with the women looking for their first points of the young season under a new head coach in Calgary. The men, meantime, were on the coast looking to build off their impressive opening weekend. Let's begin with women's soccer. First match of the year, and it's a big one, UNBC and Prince George. These teams to battle likely for playoff spots. Early on, the home girls get on the board. It's Paige Payne who goes top corner, Payne becoming UNBC's all-time leading scorer this weekend. Danielle Robertson has been among the leaders in saves since she entered Canada West three years ago. Second half, and Jordan Babich of the Timberwolves gets a chance from long distance and hits the crossbar. Robertson tested a number of times in the match, but nothing else beat her. The Wolfpack dropped the season opener 1-0. Robertson looking forward to round two with UNBC later this season. Right after the match, it was an eight-hour bus ride to Calgary for a Saturday morning matchup against one of the top teams in the nation, the Calgary Dinos. TRU, though, gets on the board first. 31 minutes in, a laser from Cameron Kurtz. First of the year for the team and Kurtz. Again, it was her longtime Courtney teammate Robertson standing on her head. Calgary with 27 shots in the contest, 13 on goal. Pack up 1-0 at the half, the Dinos getting the equalizer on a bad bounce in the 68th minute. One all the final, the women coming home with a loss and a tie. The soccer men were on the road this weekend as well. Friday night, playing on the natural grass at Trinity Western. Spartans looking for their first win in three starts. They will get on the board in the first half, working it downfield. Jacob Lowe on the near side. He one times it to the top right of the net, beating keeper Jackson Gardner. The pack with a number of chances in the second half, including off a corner kick where there's a loose ball. Josh Banton can't convert. TRU can't get the equalizer. They're blanked by the Spartans. TRU falling to a win, a loss, and a tie with the the 1-0 setback. The following night, back on turf field in Abbotsford against Fraser Valley. Eighth minute, the Cascades try and get it out. Great anticipation by Josh Banton. He uses his speed to intercept the pass, streaks in and blasts it high on keeper Ethan Duggan, Banton's first goal of the regular season. The Wolfpack controlled the second half with 12 scoring chances. Good build up here. Down the near side in the 51st minute, the play winds up with them heading the ball over top of the cage. They go to extra time, and here's where the Cascades will get the equalizer as there's a breakdown in front of Gardner. Mikel Mincella pots his first Canada West marker. One all the final. Good effort by the pack, but they wind up with one instead of three points and find themselves with a 1-1-2 one, one, record, sixth in the Pacific Division. That's the Wolfpack wrap-up this time around. For everything Wolfpack, go to our website, gowolfpack.ca. I'm Larry Reed. TRU Wolfpack TV Weekend brought to you by CFJC Sports and TRU Athletics.